सो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल लर्न विद गिग्स सो इफ यू आर वॉचिंग द वीडियो फर्स्ट टाइम ऑन दिस चैनल देन डू सब्सक्राइब एंड हिट द बेल आइकन टू स्टे अपडेटेड विद ऑल द कमिंग यूजफुल वीडियोज सो इन टूडेज वीडियो आई विल डिस्कस विद यू वन रियल इंसिडेंट दैट हैपन विद वन ऑफ माई लिंकड इन कनेक्शन आई विल नॉट टेक द नेम एज द पर्सन डिड इन वॉन्ट बट द इंसिडेंट इज रिलेटेड टू फेक एक्सपीरियंस एंड हाउ ही गॉट फायर्ड फ्रॉम हिज कंपनी ओके सो employee got fired due to his fake experience so i will let you know that real incident okay so please listen to the to this properly and completely as many of you who are watching the video might relate with this incident okay so just to give the background the person with whom this incident took place had 3.5 years of gap after his graduation and the gap was due to his family reasons now after this long gap he had to earn somehow for his livelihood okay so for that he tried to connect with his friends who were already earning in some mncs okay and then from one of his friend he got to know about this fake experience jugad and with which he could earn similar to what a 3.5 years real experienced guy earns in general okay so he went ahead and consulted with one of the training institutes who agreed to provide him 3 months of training first okay and f- and for your information this training was on power bi and sql okay and then they would schedule an interview in one of the M- mncs okay where he just have to sit and do lip sync for which also the training will be given how he has to do lip sync properly and somebody else would speak in actual and this is known as proxy interview you might be knowing about this okay and in return what was the demand from the institute it was 75000 cash plus 3 months of initial salary whatever he will initially get plus submission of class 10th and class 12th board mark sheets original mark sheets okay which they would return which they would means the training institute would return once he would pay the 3 months of initial salary of so these many complications or these many demands from the training institute okay so since that person had no prior knowledge of any language or any tool as he is from civil background and he has to earn also he agreed with the training institute conditions and many of you might also have gone through these uh, situations okay fortunately after completing the training for 3 months interview happened and interviewer couldn't catch him in the interview and he got recruited with 10 lpa package as a power bi developer with 3.5 years of real experience okay so everything was smooth and happening okay everything was everything was good okay but after and after a couple of days he joined that mnc and started earning again the things are going well and suddenly after 4 or 5 months his hr pinged him and scheduled a meeting okay in the meeting she told him that his background verification got failed and stating the exact reason that the experience certificate is fake he was clueless and hearing all all these things from hr he couldn't speak anything in front of her okay so that but but the hr was quite uh, good i would say she did not blacklist him as an immediate action as normal uh, normally any of the companies would do okay and she asked him to resign on his own okay and warned him to never do this thing again in his life okay now what has happened eventually he is not left with any money as everything whatever he earned in the in those 4 or 5 months like the first 3 months he he gave back that 3 months of salary to the training institute okay now and why did he give to get back his mark sheets so approximately 3 lakhs of money he gave to the training institute just to get that job and ultimately his job is also gone now so what can be concluded from here number 1 never get attracted from these types of perks offered by the training institute to get the job as you all have heard from the of from this incident that i narrated that what happened eventually okay number 2 even if you get a job like this you will not be able to manage the work why because you are a fresher and you will not be able to manage the requirements all the requirements from the clients in actual as you have been recruited as a 3 year experienced guy right so keep this point in mind also and the last number 3 there must be many people who would have succeeded in this kind of activity 
and managing their work also and must be earning good also so good luck to them keep working hard so that you gain knowledge and keep getting valued but there may be a situation where these training institute in the later point of time come back to you and ask for more money as otherwise they would inform about your fake experience to your current company and hence you would again give that these training institutes another amount that they will demand okay so i believe and i hope you would have chosen the right institute and you will not face this problem okay so overall my recommendation is not to get trapped in these things and do the things in a proper way you will definitely get succeed as there is no shortcut to hard work and earning more money instantly okay so let me know in the comment box what are your views on this and share this video more and more so that every get, everyone gets familiarized with these kinds of incidents okay thank you and stay tuned